This movie believer is about a man who is turned into a monster in order to catch a monster whose face, name, and even gender no one knows. Sue enters a burger place. She is a famous junkie who has also been exposed on TV, so some high school girls begin to badmouth her. Pissed off, she screams at them and kicks them out. This is police detective Wano, eager to catch Mr. Lee who runs Asia's largest drug cartel. As her former cellmate asked her to work for Mr. Lee, he begs her just to get an interview. She feels he's humane because he seems to be sorry about giving this work. The two are to meet again after the interview. However, she does not appear after the appointed time, and a picture of a parking lot is sent to him. He searches for the parking lot nearby and finds Sue losing her consciousness. When he removes the tape from her mouth, her blood and vomit flow out. He takes her to hospital, where she stares at him and draws something with her finger. He hurriedly places a receipt under her finger and she draws eight with the tip of her bloody fingernail. Wano's boss tells him to get his hands off the job, because for two years he didn't detect Mr. Lee's name, face, age, or sex, and now got a minor killed, but Wano fiercely resists saying he's ridiculed by Mr. Lee. A middle-aged woman in a gorgeous dress enters a shabby factory. Almost dying, she rushes to the police station and directly comes to the drug squad. She is Chairman Yun, who is Mr. Lee's guardian and power broker. She'll help him to catch Mr. Lee, but instead she wants to hide in here for the time being. The factory blown up was a drug factory, where a meeting of executives was scheduled, and everyone except Yun died in the explosion. She knows Mr. Lee did this because he handled her bosses the same way last year. Most importantly, she knows his name, which she doesn't say right away. Now she asks for her meal and diabetes pills. In the factory, a survivor is found, whose name is Rock. He lived in the corner of a factory and worked chores with his mother, who died in this accident. A dog is also found with severe burns. Yun, enjoying her meal, suddenly gets trouble in breathing and dies instantly. Rock doesn't respond to the police, but when Wano brings up the dog, he asks about the dog's condition. Wano immediately takes him to the veterinary hospital. Looking at the dog, Rock asks how he can catch him when no one knows anything about Mr. Lee. Wano asserts he will catch him unconditionally. Rock begins to divulge what he knows. Currently, they're trying to make a deal with Chinese buyer Jin, who rules more than half of Jilin's drug market and is also unknown like Mr. Lee. However, as Mr. Lee first sent him a sample, shocked his identity was revealed, he's claiming to see Mr. Lee in person. Tomorrow Rock is due to take managing director Park to Jin. Wano decides to take advantage of this situation, in which no one knows each other's face except Rock. Wano will meet Jin, pretending to be managing director Park. Jin, sitting down, stares at Wano with his girlfriend Bo. While Jin keeps staring at Wano, Bo rushes to say thank Rock for having given a fashion show ticket next to Lee Minnow and tries to put a new tie on for him in return. The tie clip is a hidden camera, so Wanho calls Bo loudly and praises she's as beautiful as models. She gets angry models have small breasts, pulling out Rock's tie pin and staring at him. She says it's a fake and feels sorry for him. Then Jin tells her to spin and she spins like crazy, after which she puts the tie pin into wine. Jin puts an eyeball with alcohol in a glass and offers it to Wano. He barely swallows it, promising Mr. Lee will come out next time and offering a sample. Seeing the sample, Bo rushes, takes the sample to Jin, and inhales the half and then Jin does the rest. While they're getting high, Wano asks if he accepts the deal. Jin, upset, says to fuck off and wait for his call and, taking off his clothes, runs to Bo. Now he prepares for another play, in which Wano will become Jin and meet Park. Just as Jin treated him, he repeats his words and actions to Park. Rock tries to offer a sample to Wano, but Park doubts its color, which is fake because Wano has to inhale it. That moment, another detective knocks over wine on it. Then, Park takes out not only his own sample but a new product, too. Rock stops him from showing new one but Park gets angry, and then Wano shouts them to bring them all. He inhales them all, feeling the pain of death but fulfilling his role as Jin, and exits the room. When the door closes, he collapses, and the detectives put Wano into ice water, where he sees illusion of dead Sue. Rock pulls out Wano, injects the antidote into his neck, and does CPR. Waking up, Wano shouts him to do only what he orders. After a while, a text that Jin accepts the deal is sent to Rock's phone. Receiving the raw materials from Jin's men, Rock heads to the salt factory, which will manufacture drugs instead of the exploded drug factory. The salt factory's engineers, who are deaf brothers, worked for Mr. Lee first, but after Park cut off the engineer's hand during his power struggle, they went independent. An expert interprets their sign language, 
which is full of bad words and they seem very friendly. The brothers take Rock to their dinner but not eating right away, Rock puts a spoon into the rice. When they ask why, Rock answers his mother died, but he couldn't hold her funeral because of the police investigation. Surprised, they prepare a decent dinner table for Rock's mother, saying when their father died, she did the same way for them. Everyone bows to the table and gets up, but Rock doesn't get up soon. Meanwhile, detectives find new information about Rock and Wano calls him out to the greenhouse. Young Rock in the pictures doesn't match Rock at all. Rock says the boy in the pictures died inside a drug factory. One day Rock's mother, in charge of checking methamphetamine carried in containers, found a little boy in it and raised him as Rock. Then, unexpected visitors arrive, who are Park and director Brian. Getting Park to deliver Brian's money to Rock, Brian mourns the death of Rock's mother. Rock asks if the money is from Mr. Lee, and Brian, not smiling anymore, just goes back. Park beats up Rock, angry at his rudeness. Brian tells Park to exclude Rock, and Park says it's not easy right away because he's the only liaison, but saying that was not a question, Brian hangs up. Detectives find out Brian is the son of the chairman of the E. Wu corporate, studied to become a minister, and has a criminal record that he had six believers die of a drug overdose. Wano googles Brian and finds a picture of him with a figure eight the same as Sue's dying message. Park waits for Brian in the parking lot of E. Wu building secretly, and getting a call from Brian, asks him to excuse Rock this far and no further. Then Brian gets in the car and punches him in the face without a break, saying he already warned Park never to appear here no matter what. Park tells him he will fix everything by himself. Brian says amen and Park repeats it. As manufacturing is over, when Rock hands the product to Park, Mr. Lee will show up for the final deal. But suddenly, Bo and Jin's men come and take them away. Jin asks where they were moving the product, and Wano answers they were going to be checked by Mr. Lee. Then Jin shoots the other detective as he knows they are detectives now. Suddenly falling to his knees, Wano stabs Jin's man with a pen and steals his gun. Then he rescues Rock almost dying and brings his fellow detective, who survived thanks to the flak jacket. Jin appears with a machine gun and fires anywhere, but soon the bullets run out. When Wano strangled Jin's neck, he, poking Wano's eyes, escapes from him and beats him up, loving every minute of it. Jin finds a nearby dumbbell and tries to hit Wano's head but he gets shot and collapses, which Rock fired. In a small room, Bo gasps for breath due to overdose, where Rock puts the remaining samples in her hand and retrieves the product. In the meantime, Park gets furious because Rock doesn't appear. Right before he leaves, Rock arrives. He takes the product and tells Rock he's over. Finally, a message about the meeting place and time is sent to Rock's phone from Mr. Lee, so the final play begins, in which Wano will becomes Jin again and meet Mr. Lee. When they enter an enclosed area deep inside a train station, there's a drug manufacturing room, and Brian appears from inside. While taking Wano inside, Brian orders Rock to mop things up with Park. Park takes Rock to the grow room, ties all over Rock and gives him an injection, delighted with the pain he will get. When Brian shows Wano the final product, Wano asks if he is really Mr. Lee, and he concedes spinning his ring of a figure eight. However, Wano doesn't believe it with his gut feeling. Brian calls his people, saying as an improper faith is an incurable disease, death is a healing. Then, an employee comes in with a cart, which Mr. Lee sent. When Wano opens it, there's an arm holding a phone ringing and he answers it. At that moment, a gas grenade is thrown from a distance and people wearing gas masks start shooting. Wano stops Brian from running away and they start a struggle. A seasoned detective Wano overpowers him easily but he gets shot in the shoulder and collapses. Waking up, Brian finds himself tied up. Those wearing gas masks were deaf engineers, and there's Park, dead with his arm cut off, in the corner. Rock sits down in front of Brian. He feels sorry Brian could have become Mr. Lee if he had died in the explosion. And says he has overlooked so many losers who claim to be Mr. Lee for bluffing. But it made him annoyed that Brian came to the front so boldly, and ruined his reputation with copying only his technique without logic. Looking at the picture of Rock's dog, the engineers paint on Brian's back and burn it with a blow lamp. Rock stares straight at Brian's eyes in pain. Wano receives a call from Rock, who congratulates on catching Mr. Lee and says he is going to the lobby. Rushing to the lobby, he finds Brian lying burned all over his body. Wano drives his car to the veterinary hospital and Rock's dog is gone. The police report Brian was Mr. Lee and close the investigation. Wano asserts Mr. Lee is not Brian but Rock, which is ignored. He returns his police ID card and leaves the police station. Across snowy plain, he drives following the GPS, and stands in front of a house in the middle of wilderness. 
Then Rock comes out of the house and looks at him. Just in case, Wano has a GPS tracker implanted in the dog's body. Rock says Mr. Lee is dead, but Wano says Rock is still alive. Then Rock says he doesn't even know who he is, because his parents died of drug poisoning in front of him. Wano sits putting his pistol on the table. Rock brings him coffee, also putting his pistol on the table. Wano asks Rock if he's ever been happy in his life. Rock looks at Wano, and Wano looks at Rock with tears in his eyes. After a while, a gun is fired in the house. For more videos like this, remember to subscribe and hitting the like button helps this channel continue.